We are in Mandala Kala. <laughs> More central than we expected. We focused a lot on how to get on that train. Maybe not enough on where we'd get off. That's true. An out of town depot, you say? Ooh. So these guys are like. Oh, no, they're not. I, th I guess only if it has like the yellow lines on the floor, it means. They're gonna pre fire. Okay, knock out enemies, seal all reinforcement doors. So that is a sealable door. There's two of them. Finish level without letting any enemy enemies attack. That's tough to do. Finish by the end of turn two. Hit three enemies with a single spectral skull. Okay. Uh, why is she the first one? I really wish I could change the direct. Oh, I, I kind of can. Um, I could hit three if I manage to shift in one space. So hold on. Go to Zen. It's going to come over here. Pull a force prefer over here. Shift them. Excellent. Excellent. Even better. Spectral skull, but ah, uh. and a turn two without letting enemies attack. I can do that. I can do that. I can definitely do that. Uh, she can come over. Hmm. Hold on. I want him to move the ultimate amount and then do everything I did before ah uh, I'm stupid and then Jen comes over here oh, see it would be better if he could it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Jen comes over here. Uh, she throws down the girl grenade. But, shifts her. She's at that door now. He can't, actually. He c If she moves to this door, he can then make it to this door. Seal this door. You seal this door. Chain bolts, but, but, and then back at him. Just out of here. He still got his attack. Kill him, and we are done. Nobody attacks. Nobody defends. Uh, what well, action? Okay, this this close prophet disappears. There we go. Zone one of three clear. Efficient. Efficient. Yeah, and clean. So I'm talking. Oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> right. The tail end of an end clash, something like that. I don't know what she said. Okay, what do I want to do? What how what angles can you do with chain bolts? Let's see. You can go. You can't even do that. But, but. But. Kind of like a zigzag. Okay, now these are in the back lines. It's a good thing. Yeah, why is... I was going to say, it's a good thing I got two of those. Uh... Mm. Yeah, you're about to get on my nerves. Okay, I like this angle better. There we go. 
I think since you know I don't know why I did that because since they're melee, I probably should focus on these guys that can attack long range first. And there's no window for me to throw anyone out of, which is very disappointing. Is this an ally? What? Oh, oh is this where we get the, the the? I have seen pictures of like the uh, the fourth person we get to control does have a shield. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so go with. Hmm. No, he. No. He comes over here. Three bolt. Just out of here. <laughs> and I mean, I don't even have to worry about being in cover because none of these guys are gonna make it to me. Cause they're all melee. Oh, Dal is her name or oh, his name. It sounds like a woman's name, but okay. Knuckle enemy, silo reinforcement, doors. I probably want to make it to that door, actually. <laughs> but maybe not right now. <laughs> Finish your two hostiles in one turn. Hit five enemies with a single spectral skull. Uh, can probably, probably could have made it happen before. Have Dodd deal a total of 10 knockback cumulative. But Dodd is more knockback focused. Okay, let me see if I can hit five enemies with a spectral skull. Uh, yeah, that works. Um, but. Mm-hmm. And then this chain bolt is even more effective. Actually, you know what? No. Because I don't even need chain bolt right now. I can do this. Have him come over here. Kick his ass out. And then I can chain bolts. Uh, nah. Why doesn't that work now? Okay, that's fine. Whatever. Bop, bop. Bop. Mm-hmm. Uh, knock his ass out. And she, she comes over here. Grab this intel. He grabs this intel. Put the intels down. I don't know if I'm gonna need to not grab them next turn. Get inside. I've got this. Inside yet. The curfew zone. Oh, did it? Do y'all know each other? New squad member, Dal Sabine, the Rebel Riot Priest. You've all heard of her? Or is this an icon? Oh, we do know her. She's in the armor of a chapel. Oppressors against them. She might be the only thing that hits harder than they do. <laughs> oh, okay. What is the moveset? Charge, cleanser slam, and swap. And then there's throw Raya block. Oh, that's cool. What does charge? What's, what's charge look like? Oh, well, she can only charge in one square, or is that just in one direction? Cleanser slam. I don't know. What's the movements like? First off, <laughs> she's. I hope she's good at defense because she's about to get destroyed. So she can only charge in like a certain direction. Why can't I? So she can't charge in the in the direction there are enemies at. What's happening? I don't know. If I go here, she can charge here like this. Okay. What's cleanser slam? Come here and I say cleanser slam. What the frick did that do? It didn't even shift them back or anything. 
I'm so confused. Okay, it's gonna take me a while for her abilities to kick in. Oh, she is so dead. Throw a riot block. I don't know how this helps. <laughs> this is so stupid. I don't know how to use her abilities at all. So if I say swap with her and then you swap and then you move here to seal this door because I can't be bothered to deal with everyone else and she takes their attention and is definitely dead. I'm thinking like this riot block can block the enemy's path. It can. And... Cleanser Slam... I don't know what Cleanser Slam is. Also, I think I need to be close enough. Swap is a mana action, so... Let me not forget that. Okay, you know what? We'll come back to it. Let me let me use the people that I already know how to use. Uh, so there's one there. The one there and one there actually can work. Because I can do this. And... Oh, you know, don't do that. And put that still right there. Wait, for her um chain bolts, she can do that that um cancel that. And let me see. Okay. Yep. So I can put another one. Where are you going? Yeah, this shifting <laughs> getting annoying. Uh right in front of him. And then use the chain bolt, but 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 take those two out. That's good, right there. Girl Grenade doesn't do anything for them. There are these spots right here. If I can shift him back. Force Profit. I don't think I can, but I can try. Force Profit. Right here. Hmm. That's cool. Okay, now let's do this. Sedative right here. And then he moves over here. She can move over here. Grab this intel. And then he can give her time boost so she can use the chain bolt again. And then the chain bolt can knock. Ah, oh, come on. I wanted to knock him into the gutter behind, but it doesn't look like it should be able to make that work. But she can make him work for sure. Um, dumb, dumb, dumb. <laughs> Get your ass out of here. And I think that works right now. He's pretty much useless against these armored guys. Oh, actually, wait, 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 wait. What if I do this? Predictive bolt this way. All right, and then I do the chain bolt. But, 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 doom. Mm-hmm. That works. 
is not absolutely useless. And right, now we come to her or him, whichever one. Charge attack is useless. Slam is useless. Swap. If I swap with them, he still can make it to me. That is some. But then if I throw down a riot. Oh, there we go. Oh, and then I can pick it up afterwards. 10 knockback cumulative. Um, <laughs> nah. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, I think I messed up. Because now that I put the riot there, first off, she doesn't even have the... But can she... He can... Yeah, no. Wait, but wait. You can pick it up, right? Yes. Now get... Wait. Now get your ass in there. <laughs> And I can't swap because I wanted to swap to pick up this mana thing, but it looks like I can't. There's, I don't know why. Okay, there we go. I can put it out. I was going to say, I don't know why I can't put a riot down. Yep, so he can't make it to me now. And when he makes it come this way, he's going to have to stop in front of this and then I can take him out. Bro, she's not done one knockback. <laughs> Because I don't know how to use a thing. Alright, now Jen, come over here. Use your static blast. Knock him in there. And we're done. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it. It's not very efficient, I will say that. But it's clean, though. Yeah, we'll have to come back to her knockback thing. Because I don't know why I was supposed to do that. Knock all enemies and reinforcements, uh, seal or reinforcement doors. There is three. So six reinforcements come in. Prevent five reinforcements in total. Okay, so I have to do, um, I have to seal two doors right now. Uh, I definitely want to seal this back door. And then this one maybe I don't know and finish by the end of turn two deal five slam damage with one charge by the end of turn two five slam damage with one charge oh oh she's gone just out of here uh-huh Um, if I say for Jen, oh, there's another one of these guys. I didn't even see those two. Uh, Jen can go here, use the static blast this way okay so doing damage to them doesn't incur a reaction um i can make it over here to seal this door and if i use a girl grenade at my feet can i then make it? i can't make it there still Okay, if we reset and I forget that back um, door for now, then Jen can come over here, use the static blast against him, shift him, and then comes over here, seals this door. Uh, okay, wait, I, I, did I, I think I, did I get it last time? 
the one where I can I don't I have unlimited um static blast usage. No, I didn't. Dang it. But I mean that's still a good move though to take out one of these guys. Cause it doesn't even matter, because if I use a girl grenade to shift me, I still can't make it there. Oh, hold on though. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What if I do it like this? And I'm over here before blasting him. If I use a girl grenade to shift me, now I can seal this door and I have movement to get over here. And then static blast. Sorry guys, but static blast him towards you guys. Up, up. Then I can make it over here. Seal this door. And that's two. Okay. I'm supposed to finish by the end of turn two. I don't know. I'm supposed to make that happen. Actually, if I want to make that happen. Instead of coming all the way down there. Go here, static blast. Mm. Here, static blast him this way. Still make it to this door. And... I mean, if I really want to... Oh, what does Sedative do? Ooh. <laughs> Did that damage her? It better not have. Okay, but she prob- mm, She's gonna take- I forgot this guy was there. She probably is gonna take damage this turn, which is fine. Unless I have her move over here. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Oh no, do you mind? I can have her move over here. If she takes cover, he moves over here, takes cover. Actually, nah, that would be crazy. He wouldn't, no, he can't make it. I was going to say, can I predict a ball all the way down from downtown? That would have been crazy. I can actually kill this guy, but he's already dead, so it's fine. Take cover. And throw down the right. Wait, that didn't work. Throw it down. And rewind. Throw it down here and then take cover behind it. But she can't take cover. Oh, that's fine. It only takes one damage. But. Five slam damage with one charge. I don't know what that means. Like, what can. What attack do you do? I don't know. I don't, I honestly don't know. And turn, that's fine. It's not that important. Can I swap with you? Actually, do I want to do that? No, I probably want him in the mix, right? Because Jen can go over here. Use the static blast on this guy. Get your ass out of here. And then come back here to see what this door. And then she can use transference to protect her. And uh, do, 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 do. actually, instead of using transference, she can just come over here. Wait, no. Instead of using transference, I said. That's door right. I know you can put it there. <laughs> right on this 
square can you do this square it's fine if you can't you can do that square that square works too because then you can just use a sensitive cocktail does that knock him back it does not it does not does false profit knock him back it doesn't okay that's fine let's not waste our abilities and just use transference like originally planned or oh, i can just move even closer so i'm gonna do three damage though uh he only does three damage that's fine clan slam charge can you move over here and then charge? So I need like a square space between me and the enemy to be able to charge it seems like. Hmm. And it can only be kind of in a straight line pretty much. I don't know what cleanser slam does. Let me go up to him and do it. Cleanser slam. What does that do? It does damage, sure, but it only does two damage. It doesn't do any knockback. I can just. Why am I guessing? I can just read it. Hit an adjacent target for significant damage, then knock them back. Ah, oh, it has to be an adjacent target. That's why. Hold on. And then cleanse the slam. What? Do I not know what adjacent means? Uh, reduce incoming knockback by one, which is so it should still knock him back by two because cleanse the slam does three. Oh, I does one knockback and three damage. Okay, well, that freaking sucks. You know what? It's fine. Let Jen take this. <laughs> this beaten. And then I have probably sh actually hold on. Rewind. Move her closer. I want it to be. First off, pick up this. Move him closer as well. And then full C action. And then end turn. And now you can move over here. Put this death door over here. Gen static blast. What? I finished by turn two. I completely forgot about that. Uh, we won't worry about that. That's fine. I technically could have finished by turn two if I if I figured out how to freaking knock this guy through the door i don't know why i'm so close um go here but before that do the sedative mm -hmm. and then go here that store over here static blast but just out of here and we are done. Oh, uh, these again. I still need to figure out how to use this person. Dal. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's funny. Well, it's technically all on all one street. I was going to say, why is she not jumping down? Thirsty meters. Oh, 30. <laughs> My dumb ass. 30 meters below. <laughs> I said thirsty. <laughs> right, who are you and where did you get your death wish?
chapel. <laughs> mm. Kalani's can cast. Mm-hmm. Small conspiracy. Kalani Solidarity. Oh, we're making an alliance here, ladies and gentlemen. I got one per oh, almost. I really need to get this. Or oh, is a refreshing joke? No limit on how many times refreshing joke can trigger per turn. This would be so sick. I did I have the Oh, uh, that's really good actually. I was going to say, did I have the ability? Okay. I was going to say, did I have the, you know, the points to level this up before? And I didn't. But no. So refreshing jolts is what I'm going for for her. I need to remember that. But that's, uh, I don't actually know what else I want. No, I'll figure that out later. I should I should remember that I'm getting close to upgrading Odessa. I need to figure out what's maybe can I get another death store with her and get three? If the target is pushed into the tile in front of the portal, it will pull them in. I might get that because then it makes the law transference has been useful a lot. If the protectee is an enemy or the victim is an ally. Your use is refunded when the transfer happens. So if the protect the person I'm protecting is an enemy or the victim of the what? That sounds messed up. If the victim is an enemy. They gain one unsteady when the link is created. Oh, that makes for some fun little... So if I'm going to kill like one of the small guys, I can put transfers on them, put it on the big guy as well. So I don't... Oh, I don't necessarily have to... I always thought I didn't even try to use, you know, like transfer one damage from the small enemy to the big guys. Oh, I can use it for those guys that do the reactive gun shooting. Because I think transference does like direct damage to them. That would be cool. Anyways, uh, Zan's got a point to spend. Time bomb, do I want to do that? Plus one extra action. Boost or target in a. Mm, that's cool. 
I might get the useful fiction. That would let me do a lot of like interaction based stuff. But I also really like this. If the prophet dies before it disappears, your mana is refunded. So then it becomes the goal of like the prophet kill him. You know, I like, get useful fiction. I think it sounds a lot more useful. <laughs> now we come to Dal Sabine. Hopefully, upgrades can make these dumbass abilities more useful. I actually don't like her abilities at all. I think I actually really like this panic. If enemies are targeting you when you swap, then you shoot. Then they'll shoot the person you swap with immediately. That sounds pretty fun. <laughs> I do like that. I think I'm gonna I'm choose that one. That does sound fun. Okay, I think that will do for now. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And I have to catch you in the next one. Because I got to get out of here now. But if you made it this far, I really appreciate it. And I'll catch you. And I already said that. <laughs> Let me start rambling and get, get out of your face. Alright, in a bit.